A lot of porta potties. Well, they need to flush the bullshit down somehow. Go! My name is Brian Haller. This is TrueTshirts.com. This is our company. My partner and I, we hand dye every shirt in real tea. We don't peddle anybody else's logos. We screen print our own logo on the front that we created, and we also print the pictures and the messages on the back. Anybody interested, you can go to www.TrueTshirts.com, and that's our business. And cut! Thank you. There we did. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Thank you very much. How you doing? I'm Brian. Good to talk Howard. to you. Nice I'm Zach. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you very much, sir. Ooh. It's, it's the guest book. Hmm. I'll have to sign my name there somehow. There you go, man. Alright. So um I'm gonna go uh I'm gonna leave my mark on society right now. There you go. Let's go over here and get a find a little a nice little spot we can we can put our stuff in so Zach we can wear our guns out here right oh yeah excellent yeah, is, I like my freedom now um, yeah. I'm liking freedom already see, um, that's okay. hang on I think there's a little, little space down here down where no one's going okay I'm zooming in I'm zooming in style where I just moved the whole camera Yay! Yay! It's flashing red too. Does that mean anything for you? That means it's recording. Okay, great. Yeah. You want me to stop? Um, whenever you're ready. You want to bother these? All right. Um, I'll do location shots for you. All right. This is uh, yeah. I just, I just left my my mark on the uh, on the guest book. Good man. Wall. You're John yes. Hancock, so to speak. Indeed, my my John Hancock. Yes. A very, very, very topical. Yes. <laughs> what better way to uh, to sign your name than putting a huge ass signature that does nothing but draw attention to you? That's right. Huh? And you put a Bible quote. Oh, I'm sure. and and over there, the John Hancock. The John Hancock Building. Exactly. Which exemplifies your John Hancock. The tallest building on the Boston skyline. What's this? Bastion of capitalism. The Hancock. My father used to work there. May he rest in peace. The, the Hancock fade to the Hancock. Whoops. Blocked. Huh. Hancock blocked. Hancock blocked. <laughs> okay, so you just missed the funniest exchange of the day. It was the funniest thing ever, and now it's lost for forever. But, oh well, there's candy money. All right, candy money. There. All right, look, the rest of this thing is just going to be phoned in, okay? What's up, people? Printing. All right, so this this is it. Boston Common. And out there, that's the tea party right there. All the news vans light up. You've seen them already. They got a little marketplace set up right down over that way. And at the back, that is the, uh, that's the stage. It's where the Wicked Witch of the North is going to be showing up eventually. Give a hoot. Don't pollute. There we go. Now everyone's happy. Nice, nice stuff. Uh, what what does your what does your sign say? <laughs> Ooh, it's very graphic. Nice. Comes from the weekly dig. I see. And what's what's that? Dump Sarah Palin into Boston Harbor. Ooh, incitement to riot. I can see why you got kicked out. So you you all got got thrown out of this place, right? Well, we were told to move to the state house. Yeah. All right. So uh, now. Now you have been banished. banished I see. From, from I see. Yeah. So much for freedom of speech. Exactly. Jerks. Nice. And what else? What else have we got over here? What we is got that? Um, one less government moved to Somalia. Ah. That's what you want small government. They got the smallest government around. I see. <laughs> I don't think they have a government. Exactly. That's the point. Indeed. Right. Cool. Nice stuff. Yeah. What do we got over there? More people coming around. Let's go right ahead. A government big enough to give you everything you want is strong enough to take away everything you have. I remember that quote. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. America will never be destroyed from the outside. If we fall for and lose our freedoms, it will be because we destroyed ourselves. And socialism is a philosophy, the philosophy of failure, the creed of ignorance, and the gospel of envy. By a Brit. What's a quotation from a British person doing here? Winston so Churchill. <laughs> See, look at that. Look at that. Bloody Tory, you are. Ooh. Oh, 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 lots of reading. This is going to take a while. 
The retards can't give one logical reason why we should be against universal health care. So cut out the middleman. Where does the insurance company get off thinking that they deserve a cut anyway? Health care is a human right. Oh, oh you're a sure, subversive. And you're one of those You're one of those evil subversives who's creeping in here trying to spin the crowd. Yeah. I'm yeah. a proud earthling, my friend. A proud Indeed. earthling. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, being called a subversive by the guy in the Karl Marx t-shirt. Yeah, get a get a shot of that. Yeah. 